To start, name the central topic with the title of your research. For our tutorial, the research will be about the geological development of the Earth. Format the central idea the way you like. Change the text format, font size, topic color. In this example, the central topic will have no shape. You can move the central topic anywhere in the map space. To add image to the topic, go to the library panel Image tab. Click the Add Image button, specify the image file location and simply drag the image and drop it to the topic. Also change the image placement in the topic against the placement of the text. You can insert subtopics by using the drag and drop option from the topic menu. Use the shortcut key Insert to also add subtopics. For adding sibling topics, press Enter. Continue adding the main categories of your research. Organize the topics by using the auto alignment line. Drag the topics against another, view the possible positions and drop it. Apply underlined shape to all topics. Change the text formatting and to each topic apply the same fill color as the line color of the ties. While you research the web, you can add the searched images by simply dragging and dropping them to the desired topic. Some of them even add a hyperlink to the topic. Also, automatically build your mind map by simply clicking on a link and the selected link appears as a subtopic to the page it originates from. Continue creating your research. To keep track of your researched website links, open the desired page, select the topic and from the internal browser select the button Add Website as a Topic. If you want to know more about iMindQ, visit the link below.